What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of whatever the hell this is. I don't know what to call it. I'm just out here shooting videos, guys. Today, I'm going to show you how to turn trash into cash. Um, this is not <laughs> one of the normal things that I show on my channel. Uh, but as you can see from the opening video I just shot, that you can pick this up off the side of the ground side of the ground off the ground the floor in a tree whatever you want to call it and uh and you can turn this into money now this is a diet mountain dew bottle okay this actually was mine okay i bought this but i put it down on the ground and around some other trash and you know walk up on it and picked it up just to kind of give the idea what i mean which is as you all know, <laughs> these things are everywhere. They're all over the place, right? So, uh, I started doing this like a month ago. Now, I don't drink a whole lot of this. I don't drink a whole lot of Mountain Dew. I don't, I mean, I do and I don't. I Put it this way. I used to buy a lot of these. A lot. I was always buying these fucking things. Uh, <laughs> the way I was raised, I mean, you always had some Pepsi... You always had some Mountain Dew. You always had some kind of soda. Like, that's what you had. If And, and you started trying to figure out how you were going to get more before you ran out. Okay, so that's how much we used to drink of this. Now, back in the day, I don't know if any, any of you guys remember the Pepsi Points. Remember that? We used to have all kinds of stuff from, uh, from Pepsi Points. I used to get all kinds of shit from uh, the Pepsi Points, like hacky sacks and T-shirts and all kinds of shit. But anyway, now they've stepped it up. And you can actually get paid PayPal with this. If you see this little symbol right here, that Pep coin, right, by PepsiCo, that means that you can get paid by PayPal from this. So it, it isn't a crazy amount of income, but it does help. Every little bit helps. And in case you guys haven't noticed, everything that I do I try to make sure I'm getting a kickback or a discount or something free or anything uh, just to not so things don't cost so much. I'm, I'm constantly getting free shit. Every day I'm getting free shit. Um, so if you are somebody that drinks a lot of this, then this could really benefit you. And there are people, and I know that there are people out there that drink a shit ton of Pepsi products and Mountain Dew products, right? I used to drink a lot of this, but uh, then I started dipping Grizzly Wintergreen, and uh, and when I started dipping Grizzly Wintergreen, I was like, shit, man, I can't, I can't be doing this, because that's just, I was turning, I was going full-blown redneck too fast, and it freaked me out, right, so, so I stopped drinking so much Mountain Dew, it's like, I'm just kidding, that's not what happened, but, uh, <laughs> But anyway, I dropped my notes down here, so I had to grab them. So people who drink a lot of this, right? You can really benefit from this. Um, I did this when I first started doing it. I think it was giving me like 48, 50 cents per bottle that I was doing. And all I had to do was uh, take, the, take the lid off. And there's a little code under the lid. And then after you, you got to put the code in. And then you put the barcode in. And it'll give you, it'll give you that money off, and it goes straight to your PayPal. And once, and you only need a dollar for it to cash out. Now this has paid me, so that's why I'm doing this. Like I said, it's, it's not a crazy amount of income, um, but I wanted to make the point that, and I've done this before, and it's not something I like brag about because I don't want it to seem like, look at me out here helping people. You know what I mean? I I, I believe in helping people. I believe in giving people you know, helping people like homeless people and shit like that. Um, I don't, I'm not really a huge fan of giving them money, but I'll buy them food and stuff like that. And, and listen, I don't have a whole lot of money, but when I can, you know, I'll help them out. If I'm going to 7-Eleven, grab a hot dog or something, and I got something free anyway, I'll, I'll grab it, you know, grab something free and give it to the homeless guy down the road. A lot of my shit, uh, well, I don't know about a lot, but a lot of times I'll give these homeless guys out here, um, food. And I'm not supposed to doing the job that I do, but I can't help it. Um, but another thing that I'll do is I'll help them with stuff like this. We have a guy out here 
and uh you know i don't want to say his name or anything like that i, I talked to him and and he's homeless and he kind of lives in the area uh wherever he can and i've bought him food a couple of times and once i got to know him a little bit and got to see that okay this guy's not an absolute whack job he's not crazy he doesn't seem like a criminal stuff like that he seems like a decent guy and he has a phone and he pays a phone bill and he has unlimited data and i grabbed him i said dude check this out man I, I can't give you a whole bunch of money i don't have it like that to just be here buddy have some money but i can show you a bunch of different stuff where you can make money from i showed that man this with the with the track with the bottles and he's making money doing this he's got a paypal account he's got a bank account because he gets a pay he gets a check probably uh, he gets a government check and uh and he, so he has a little bit of money but i've given him all kinds of stuff that he can do to make money on the side and new stuff that things that i haven't shown on my youtube channel that i do and i just and i've made it a point to sit there and and go through everything that i do and i was going what can he do what can, what is best for him and uh and i i just hammered him one day with all this stuff and he loved it i mean he was getting gift cards left and right and, and he's like sending me screenshots because you know i got his phone number of course and he's sending me screenshots of stuff. Oh man, thank you so much. I've been, I've been doing this. I've been doing that. And he's, he's making income on the side from all this stuff. This is somebody that has nothing. So, you know, some, some people will look at what I do and they go, ah, oh, that's, that's not shit. You know, I, I make, you know, this much X amount of dollars a year. Well, to somebody it's something, you know, and to me it's damn sure something. I don't make a whole shit ton of money, you know, so this helps. Any, anything I do helps me um, save money. And like I said, it's it's easy stuff to do. You know, it's just a matter of being lazy. It's a weird bird right there. What kind of damn bird is that? But anyway, I gave the guy all kinds of options and stuff he can do. And he's actually literally picking these things up off the ground and making money with them every once in a while. Now, not all of them work. You have to make sure it has that pep pep coin symbol on it so like if you're going to buy one of these and you're standing in the checkout line or something where, where a lot of these are sold and you're going to do this make sure it has that little symbol on it that pep coin symbol or it's not going to work and then you i'm going to show you guys where to go i'm going to take you in my phone screen and show you how to do it it's super simple um and like i said you can get these off the uh off the ground so i told him about it he started making all kinds of money i got notes right here because i tend to forget stuff um, that I want to talk about and um, but anyway that guy he ended up uh, you know he, he's, he was doing all this stuff he was making money with these uh, picking these things up off the ground he was doing you know his own because he drinks his own he buys his own so it's giving him a little kickback and like I said he's got a whole bunch of other things that I showed him that he's making money on he's like uh, he loves it he's super into it he's like oh man check this out now he's sending me stuff oh dude did you ever do this no man what's that so now we're kind of working together like he's helping me out he showed me a couple things um and i'm like man that's cool because he's got nothing but time to sit there and and check stuff out and look for stuff so now i've got him in the mindset of well if there's all these other things that exist that this guy showed me there must be all kinds of other stuff out here and now he's out there hunting down this stuff himself and he's making himself an income from his phone plain and simple before you know it, his phone bill his, his phone's going to be paying its own bill um, so I, I feel good about that. I helped that man and you know, I can't I can't give him, you know A lot of things that he needs, but I feel good that I helped him and uh, you know At least have something to do to make a little bit of income So and he's not the first one I've done that to with either and of course it it benefits me as well It helps me as well with a lot of a lot of things some things don't some things don't have a referral system anything like that if I show it to you it doesn't benefit me at all, you know what I mean? And I and I show them things anyway. I take my time and show those things. I got to do videos about those too because there's some really good ones um, that I need to show you guys. It's just a matter of having time. And I'm doing this one so I can stop carrying this fucking Mountain Dew bottle around with me. <laughs> so, uh, now just keep in mind with this kind of thing, uh, when they're saying, oh, we're going to give you uh, you know money for buying our product, this shit is designed now it's designed to keep you coming back oh you know if i can 
they, they don't just want to give you money. Don't think, oh, Pepsi, PepsiCo is a great fucking company. They just want to give me some money back. No, they, it is a ploy to get you to buy more of this shit. If you're aware of that, right, and you already buy this shit, like I already, I don't buy any more of these than I normally would just because, oh shit, I can get a little, a uh, little money back. Like I, I, I'll look at things and be like, okay, I can, I can buy that for a buck or I can buy that for two bucks and get 40 cents back. It makes more sense to buy this, you know, I'll, I'll, but if I happen to buy one of these, sometimes I will just say, oh, fuck it. Give me a Mountain Dew. There's here money back right there. So it's, it's good to know. It's good to have, um, what did my notes say? So, uh, Oh, I wanted to mention that they put a lot of research into these kind of things. And, okay, well, if uh, if we put, you know, the symbol on and made people cash out for, for PayPal, you know, what, what are the numbers, what are the statistics, algorithms, all this shit, it's going to end up making them money. They they would not do that unless it ended up making them money. So them, them giving you that little bit of kickback is going to end up making them money. They probably got some kind of deal with PayPal um, where PayPal makes money too. Also Venmo says right here also Venmo I don't know if you can see that I don't use Venmo so um, I mean I have used Venmo but not like that so but also Venmo this will pay you with Venmo um, rest assured that they're making money off this they're making way more money than they're losing uh, by keeping people coming back so and I already mentioned that not all of them have that symbol, that Pepco symbol. And this is not going to be forever. This is not going to be it for everything, guys. So take advantage of it while you can. Who knows how long it's going to last. If you already buy a shit ton of Mountain Dew products and Pepsi products, that may benefit you, you know. And I, and I assume that certain stores probably carry that product or those particular ones. So, you know, if you find them at one place, they're probably, you know, more likely to be there at a convenience store or something like that. But... Anyway, guys, uh, that's enough of me rambling. I'm going to uh, shoot another video, go into my phone screen, and actually show you guys the process and how to do this and try to show you my payment proof that I've only been paid $1 with this so far, but it it was like $0.40 cents a piece. But after you first start, when I first started it, it gave me, uh, it was like a bonus. I don't know if it was like a special, you know, time or since I just started, it was giving me like $0.48 cents per bottle. And now it's only giving me like 19, 20 cents per bottle, but that's 20 cents per bottle. I will damn sure enough bend my big ass over and pick up 20 cents off the ground right now. So <laughs> I will damn sure enough enter a code into a database to get the uh, 20 cents back on that on PayPal. But anyway, guys, that's enough. I'm going to go into my phone screen and show you guys how to do that. Let's go do that. Okay, guys, so here we go. This is the um, screen of my phone here. It's uh, October 5th. 2020 i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to turn trash into cash boy so if just real quick if you're not my friend on facebook here's me this is my actual real profile because so many people are trying to recreate it and pretend they're me it's not even funny I get it all the time like people just all all trying to be me and stuff this is me right here this is the real me um so i deleted all my facebook friends i explained that in the video i shot yesterday i have not released that video yet but it will be in succession so i don't have a whole lot of friends now because i deleted everybody and uh it's taken forever to get my actual friends back but uh that's me send me a friend request send me a message if you ever have any questions on anything i do this real quick uh is just a, a payment proof one of the payment proofs that i have uh, from Pepcoin for doing this. It's not a whole lot, but a dollar is a dollar. I'll take it Excuse me. Just ate lunch, but um, That's free money guys. So there it is. There's payment proof for that and I wanted to show you real quick uh, I've seen a lot of people um, and, and dealt with a lot of people that <laughs> Where they just want everything I do like show me what you do show me what you do and I just sit there hammering them uh, with all these applications and all this different stuff and uh from what I see that people are doing, they're pretty organized with it. Uh, they're hunting through their phone. I'll be like, hey, pull up this app and let's check it out and I'll try to help you get it working or whatever because I, I deal with a lot of people one-on-one, um, -on -one, you know, personally too in real life. And, um, you know, so I see how they keep their stuff. And I just want to show you guys, like, this is how I keep mine. I'll make a little folder and I'll put all kinds of stuff in it. Now, 
this is all stuff that I've done videos on. Um, I'm not going to show you guys the things I do um, that are <laughs> that I haven't done a video on. I'm, I'm going to leave that for later for you guys to uh, keep watching my videos. But um, anyway, this is just a few things that I've done videos on, um, and I put them in this little folder so I can show you an example. I have another folder with just page after page of all kinds of stuff like this, right? So what I'll do is I'm getting ready to go to Pepcoin. So that's at the bottom and just me being me, I'll take that and I'll put it here. And that way, it what it does is it'll keep the best things current because I'm going to be messing with the best things, right? I'm not going to be messing with something that sucks all the time. So the things that tend to suck or not be so great, they'll fall all the way to the bottom of the list. Like I'm always into Cash App. So this one's always up here. I'm always into Cash App. I'm always messing with Cash App. I'm always doing something with Cash App. Um, and it also helps me to know like, okay, I just did some surveys on mobile performance meter. Uh, I caught that up for the day. You know, uh, you know, I can't mess with this stuff all day long, but as you can see, I'll be like, okay, I haven't done, I haven't done this cause Plinko master, that's a daily kind of thing you want to do. It resets daily. You get more points. So I'll be like, damn, Plinko master fell all the way to the bottom. Let me go ahead and mess with that for a while. If I'm, you know, in the bathroom or whatever, if I got a minute to mess with it, I need to mess with that. Or 7-Eleven, this also now has a daily thing that you do for points. Okay, I need to mess with that. Let me get that going. Oh, I'm back to Pepcoin. So I'm going to Pepcoin, and I'll open that. And if you if you don't know how to get that as a little symbol right there, or an icon, because it's not an app. This is not an app. This is a website. So you can take and put your own little symbol for the website, and when you tap the symbol, it's the same thing as having the app on your phone, except you're going to the website. So if you don't know how to do that, I can show you how to do that too. Just send me a message. It's pretty easy. Uh, you can do that for just about anything. Uh, anything that's a website, you can put a little app icon and then you have it there. But anyway, I already have it pulled up. <clears throat> so here it is. Uh, this is what the website looks like. And I don't mess with none of this stuff. Um, you can also do chips, uh, Lay's, Cheetos, stuff like that. Anything that's made by Pep Pepco or whatever the hell it is, PepsiCo. Um, you can get these points as long as it has the the markings on the package. So if you buy a lot of chips and, and you know, we do get Doritos and Fritos and all that kind of stuff. So um, I, I probably should be doing this a little bit more. Um, but anyway, we're going to start new scan. And there's a bunch of different ways you can do it. You can hit start new scan right there. You can go down here to scan. Or I can fi find Mountain Dew right there and, and tap the plus and go into it there. Um, so there's a bunch of different ways you can do it. I'm just going to go to start new scan. Move this out of the way. Where am I going to put me? Put me right there. Uh, step one of two, enter drink code. To verify your purchase, scan or type in the 10 character under the cap code. That's right here. Under the cap. So the code is K3AZT. And it's all caps. And as a general rule, for me, anything that involving a password or enter a code or anything like that, I always do it how it's shown. It's shown under the cap in all caps. So I, I put caps lock on. Whoops. Okay. 3A. Z. T. 6. M. 9. T. X. Or you can scan cap code, which I don't know how the hell the fuck that works, but continue. I, I also never scan stuff like this. I always enter it manually. Um, I just, I don't like the whole scan thing. <clears throat> so you, now you need the barcode. Not only do you need the cap, at least for the sodas, I haven't done a bag of chips or anything, but I assume it's the same. I don't know where they would put the code at, probably on the inside of a bag of chips. I don't know. Anyway, this is for a soda bottle. I haven't done chips yet. So one more step. Scan the barcode on the side of the drink to confirm your flavor or enter the eight to 12 digit barcode. Like I said, I don't scan, um, I, just, I just don't. I don't like doing it that way. So I'll go in here and enter the code. Now, if you see this, there are small numbers and big numbers here. You wanna enter the small numbers too. There's a number all the way to the left, there's a number in the center, and there's a number all the way to the right. So you're gonna enter that whole number. So that number is 0121, 0121, 
340, 340, and then the number all the way to the right is a five. I'm gonna check it, 0121, 0121, 340, 340, five. Okay, submit. Scanning success, thank you for completing your product scanning. We received your submission and you should see deposit points momentarily. Let's see, I was at 79 cents, 98, oh, almost another dollar to cash out. Great job you earned. So if I go find another bottle, which I probably could, I should, I should go try to find one. And uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go into 7-Eleven and I'm gonna go to the cooler and I'm gonna open the bottle and I'm gonna scan the code and get the code off the lid and then put it back in the thing. Epiphany moment. Hmm. There's a bunch of different ways you can get this stuff, right? Hey, if somebody comes out of 7-Eleven, I see you bought a Mountain Dew. Can I scan your bottle? Can I get your cap? Okay. If I was a homeless dude, psh, I'd be racking stuff up, boy. I'd be right outside the 7-Eleven. You're not, you can't be out here asking for money. I'm not asking for money. I'm asking for uh, Mountain Dew codes and barcodes. Hey, can I have the lid and the in the uh, the wrapper to that? Yeah, sure. Here you go. It's worth uh, 20 cents to me. Instead of Sarah, can I have? Can you got any change? No. Anyway, guys, that's how you do it. Real quick, I'm not gonna keep blabbing. It's super easy. Payout brand. Oh, here we go. I'll check, show you this real quick. Put me over here. Uh, this is just what it's done for me. Like I said, when I first started doing it, I was getting 47 cents per bottle. Uh, then it paid me a buck. Then 19, 19, 19. So it starts you off like, oh my god. I was like, wow, 50 cents per bottle. That's not bad. This is how many of these I've bought since 9-7, right? So it's really not a whole lot, but every little bit helps to me. And uh, it's something else, you know, that can help you if you drink a lot of this stuff. So anyway, guys, that's the end of the video. And uh, I think that was all I had to say about it. Like I said, it pays out in Venmo and PayPal. Um, uh, Mountain Dew Diet Mountain Dew has zero grams total fat. Uh, sodium 85 Mijica. Whatever that means, total carbs, bigger than one or something. Uh, total sugars, added sugars, 1%. Hmm. Serving size is one bottle and calories are 10 per serving. 10 calories per bottle, that's not bad. If you guys like the content, subscribe. Smash the subscribe button, I should say, because that's the cool way to say it. Smash the subscribe button and turn on your notifications. And um, what else? I don't think this is referral based. I'm going to have to check that because I don't think there's a referral system on this. Uh, but anyway, guys, that's it. That's the end of the video. I appreciate you for watching. Peace. Wait, 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 wait. I should have said this part too. I just realized that I didn't say this uh, to actually get to uh, the, the Pepcoin website. Just go to Google. Pepcoin. Boom, you're in there. In case people are like, well, how, how do I get to this thing? I realize that uh, some people might not be able to figure that out. It's not <laughs> it's not that hard. You just go to Google, type in Pepcoin, boom, it'll take you there. You create an account. Uh, you give it an email address, or you can sign up with Facebook, uh, stuff like that, um, Twitter, um, or just give it an email, and it'll create an account for you, and then it'll save your stuff. And then you can go to the three bars right here on top of my head, like I said, and you can add to home screen, right? Add to home screen. This is how you do that part. I wanted to record this part anyway. My phone's being slow because I crushed all my data for this month. There it is. Add to home screen. Pepcoin. I'm going to hit add. It's going to say, is this, is this the icon you want to use? Yes. Add it, please. Shortcut to Pepcoin. Add it to home screen, right? So now I'm going to have two boom there's one whoops and then there's one. Oh, oh god what did i do anyway you get the point <laughs> stop it now i'm drawing on the screen i didn't know i could do that there's the pep coin icon there and there's another one in here because i added two but all i gotta do is get that off of there delete it whoops Stop. Go away. 
remove from home screen. So now I got just one. That's how you do it. Actually, I like that one better. I'm going to redo that because I don't like that little Google symbol on there. But anyway, guys, that's how you do it. Uh, like, subscribe, share the video. Uh, tell all your friends and family. If you have anybody sleeping in your house right now, wake them up immediately and tell them to watch this video. Um, call somebody in Australia if you know them and tell them to subscribe to my channel. Um, and I'd appreciate it. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Why'd I do that?